as a company, SWT is committed to the education and in, into our into our staff and our customers as an investment to help the agriculture community succeed through through SWT. So, what we do is we uh, have these plots. We've started doing the plots about three years ago, and we we do things throughout the plots with such as variety trials, insecticides, fungicides, seed treatments, uh, fertilizer rates. So far we've got some seed treatment trials in there and there's a new product from Syngenta called uh, Cruiser um, Vibrance Quattro which is really looking um, like it's showing ahead of the other seed treatment products. So the, it's coming out, it came out of the ground a little bit faster and the, the crop is or the plants are growing a little faster as well so they're they're about a full leaf ahead of the other ones right now. Brad's in charge of, of lining up the plots and does a great job of figuring out uh, what the customers are interested in, what they want to learn about throughout the year. So we have some canola varieties in there and there's a couple that are starting to show that they're hitting their first and second leaves a little faster than the others. but not really anything to of real note yet. Um, the big thing we did with our plot trials um, was actually just since we had a bad frost was to take guys out and show them how to evaluate um, whether their canola stand was going to be viable um, and have some conversation about what to do to try to maybe improve the vigor and um, reduce the insect pressure and stuff in there because it's going to be a little bit worse with a reduced plant stand. It's all to for our own education is trying to sell to the customers, uh, provide the customers with the best bang for their buck, I guess you would say. And so we do these trials and we bring the customers in so that they can get hands-on education of how things have progressed, how to get to see insects firsthand, get to see diseases firsthand, and then see which products might fit their farmer operation the best. This year we are focusing a lot on, um, well, three crops, in, in particular canola, lentils, and derm. Um, so in the canola we're just looking at a couple of new seed treatment products and then of course a variety trial because in the canola hybrids are constantly changing. So we want to make sure that um, the varieties we're recommending for producers are, are the correct ones. Um, and see if the new ones coming down the line are going to be better than the past ones for this area. It's amazing how the hands-on education for the customers progresses and once they start coming out we've seen our customer numbers increase year after year after year and once they figure it come to the first one a lot of them follow it straight through right through throughout the growing season we have number of plot trial days and they follow it through and I mean they're excited to learn about it because it's stuff that really pertains to, to our growing area um, and to their farms. We also will be looking at some fungus, some new fungicides to be on the market for lentils a little later on in the year once they're big enough to have that put on. And just as sort of an interesting thing for guys to look at, we have a new crop called faba beans in there. Um, I don't know how well suited they are for this area, but we had a few guys asking about them, so we just thought we'd throw a few in. So if guys were asking some simple agronomic questions like seeding rate and fertility and such, we'd have a little bit of an idea where to start from. And that's what we want. We want to educate farmers to help them be more successful, which in turn helps us as a company be more successful and move forward and educate everybody.